Hello and welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make this chicken farm right behind me. The killing mechanism with the foxes was inspired by Tango Tech. So if you guys want to go check out the video that I got it from, you can go ahead and go down into the description below and click on the link. Just the bottom part of the design was built by him and the top part here is my design. And if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and if you're new around here, consider subscribing. This chicken farm is quite unique from the other chicken farm designs because this chicken farm is using a mechanism with foxes and they're holding swords in their mouths which have fire aspect 2 and looting 3 on them and that actually makes the drops of the chicken more likely to produce more meat and they're also going to be cooked so as you can see it is cooked chicken and this was from like three chickens and you get a lot more because of the looting effect on these swords and trust me this farm is so much more efficient than the others because if a chicken drops down here it has the chance to drop three cooked meat in this little chest down here and you'll get so much more meat than all the other farms now let me show you how it works so the top part here is just filled with chickens obviously you're gonna have to breed them and there are hoppers below them down here like so and in here there's a little redstone pulse and what it's going to do once it detects that there's an egg in the dispenser it will just um, dispense the egg onto this slab onto this half slab here where the chickens will grow up and once all the chickens are grown up uh, you'll just flip this little lever here and they'll come down here where the foxes will kill them with their um, fire aspect swords and looting swords and you'll get quite a lot of meat into this chest here and these le little levers down here are just to lock the hoppers but they're really not necessary and that is literally the build and it's so simple and it's such a small design and you'll get so much meat from it so just for a demonstration right here the chickens aren't grown up obviously but if they are uh, if you see them grown up there's going to be quite a bit of them uh, just flip this little lever here and that will drop them down into this little trap door here where they will be killed by these foxes here and as you can see they just got killed and their meat will just go into this chest here and you'll just flip it back once you're done with that and just let them grow up and you'll repeat the process over and over again and you'll get quite a lot of chicken from it so to build this farm you're actually going to need two uh, diamond swords so you're gonna have to be pretty established to build this and you're also going to need these four enchanted books for your diamond swords so just get an anvil and you're gonna have to enchant these with fire aspect and again you're gonna need um, a looting three book and do that on the other sword as well so with looting and you're gonna need fire aspect as well so just keep that in mind you can get these trades from villagers and you're also gonna need two foxes so make sure you're near a spruce biome or a place where foxes spawn all right i'm gonna go ahead and start with the build so first off just place down a chest here and this is gonna be the middle of your build so just keep that in mind and then place down two blocks on the side here and place a hopper here and a hopper going into the hopper there and another one here like this and then go ahead and place two stone slabs here with an iron um, trap door on the top of this hopper here make sure it's the middle hopper like that and then place two dirt blocks or grass blocks on the sides and then place down two levers on these two blocks here what this is going to do is lock the hoppers in the back so you can give the sword to the foxes once you're ready to do that so just flip these two down and those will lock the hoppers automatically all right now we're going to place glass around it so the foxes don't escape so three here one on each side like so and that's going to be five in total and then just place three here and one on the bottom make sure you leave this spot open and then in the back as well just place down glass and on just do the same thing on this side so three on the top there and then over here do the same thing so just kind of encase it but just don't place a block there that's basically it and then go ahead and place a block here and then this is going to be a temporary block and then place two trap doors so one here and one here make sure it's facing into that block and then go ahead and break this block here and then flip these two trap doors down like that now go ahead and get your foxes inside of your little chamber here i know it's going to be pretty hard to get them in survival mode but all you can do is just get some leads and just get them into the chamber like so if you're doing this in survival so just do that if you're doing survival but if you're doing it in creative just spawn them in it's a lot easier but yeah like that and you have your two foxes in there and then just give them your enchanted diamond swords and these will last a very long time and also i mentioned earlier that you have to lock the hoppers and then give it to both of them 
and they should have them in their mouths. If the fox have a different item in their mouth and are not picking up the diamond swords like a, a piece of wheat or something, uh, just place down a berry bush here and just bone meal it. And what that's going to do is eventually the uh, berry bush is going to grow up and it's going to uh, launch a berry right here onto the slab and the fox is going to eat it and it's going to drop whatever item it's holding. So just keep that in mind, but just take away these berry bushes here. Um, for the time being. Alright, now come to the front of the build and place a building block there, and then just place a sticky piston like this, and then place a slab right here. And what that's gonna do is, when your chickens are all grown up, you can just retract it with this lever here. So place a lever there, and you can flip it, and what that's gonna do is just do that, and make sure it's the slab is over the machine like so. And then place down a dispenser here, facing into that little slab there. And that's where all your baby chickens are going to end up eventually. Now we're going to do the little redstone in the back of the build here. So just place down three building blocks like this and three on this side and three on the other side as well. And then place down a redstone comparator here and then just right click it once like so. And then place a repeater here and then another repeater here facing that way. So a little setup like that and place redstone dust along the blocks like that and that is it all right now we're going to build this up so come to this piston here and then place a block here one here on the side so it's covering the fox and then go up one two three like that so it should be like a little l shape on and do it on the other side of here as well so one one and then one two three like that and then place down one, two blocks in the front like this. All right, now all you have to do is place hoppers into this little dispenser here and one, two, three hoppers like that out of the back. And then place down carpets on these three hoppers there. And then place a block here and you should have a little setup like this. And then place down blocks all along this here. So just surround the hoppers with blocks. And then right here, just do the same thing. And you should have a little space here. And then place a temporary block here and then one two glass on the top and this is where you're going to get your chickens in so just build it up too high like this and just get your chickens in you can use a lead or you can just get two chickens in there um, and then breed them up or you can just get eggs and chuck them in there and i would recommend having a decent amount of chickens in there the more chickens in there the more eggs that will be produced and that means the more cooked chicken down here so just make sure you have a lot of chickens up here and yeah and then right here just place down a block there to cover it up all right and that is it for the build it is very simple as you can see and it works great and once you run it for a little bit and you have lots of chickens up here you'll get lots of meat guaranteed and if you guys enjoyed this video make sure to give it a thumbs up and if you're new around here consider subscribing and as always thank you for watching and see you in the next video bye bye